Okay, well, first of all, I'll be starting my next yearly dry fast in about two or three days here. And prior to that, I tend to do a little electrolyte loading. One of the things that I've talked about over the years is, you know, the necessity to come out of the fast by loading up your electrolytes because you've depleted a lot of electrolytes during a dry fast. In that respect, I think it's probably a good idea to preload with some electrolytes as well. Because when you think about it, not everybody eats from a garden like this. Not everybody eats a lot of really healthy foods. A lot of people have a very poor diet. It's statistically known that almost everyone suffers from a magnesium deficiency. And probably a sodium deficiency too because of all this low salt silliness. So it's probably a good idea to load up on the baking soda and water right before the fast, some magnesium pills, 100 milligrams, 500 milligrams, um, and potassium pills, 100 milligrams, uh, before you start a fast, just to load up on some electrolytes, just as a safeguard. It'll probably make it easier coming out of the fast, make it easier to replenish your electrolytes, and it's about that easy. Because again, I don't know how you eat. I don't know if you're eating like I do, or a lot of the people that I know. And um, as you can see, my garden is five months into it, started in January, and I've got lots of food now. It takes about three to five months to start making food out of a garden. And all this stuff is delicious. Mm. And fresh. Okay, so here's the deal. Um, before I go into my dry fast, I'll be doing a little electrolyte loading. I like watermelon. Still do, always have. I love to eat a watermelon, half a watermelon or a small, half of a large lot of watermelon or a small watermelon the day before a fast. And it um, doesn't matter the, the, the sugar content stuff. You're just going to use it all up in the first couple of days when you're not eating or drinking. And then you just go into this wonderful state of uh, repair, autophagy. And that's why we're doing this, is to get all the bad stuff out so that all the good stuff can happen and to turn it off long enough to turn your stem cells on. So this is a video announcing that I will start a new dry fast in about three days. Uh, it's Tuesday now, so I'm thinking Friday and over the weekend I'll start my dry fast and I will keep you in touch every day with what I'm doing. Anyway, so that's it and I will talk to you later.